to my channel. Happy Mask Monday. I think I'm going to try the Youth to the People mask and this did come in a kit that I had purchased and tomorrow's video I will be reviewing the cleanser and the moisturizer out of this kit. The mask did come in here as well and it does have kale spinach in it, microalgae, so we will see. It's made in California. The directions say apply a generous layer to face and neck Wait 10 to 15 minutes for the mask to replenish your skin. Rinse thoroughly with warm water. Use two to three times per week. So in that shipment, I'm assuming this is what happened. So I know a lot of times product does arrive like that, so that's kind of a bummer. But okay, so we're gonna go ahead and apply this. It did not say to apply to a damp skin. So I'm just going to try it dry and see what happens because it seems like usually on the mask they say to apply to a damp skin if they want you to. And on the cleanser directions that came in this kit too, it does say to apply to a damp skin. So I'm assuming that you don't. So a generous layer to face and neck. So I don't know how much of the neck I'll do here on camera, but... There is a little bit of an odor. It's very creamy. And but it just kind of smells I guess I'd say like an earthy, if that makes sense. An earthy tone scent. And just as an off-topic kind of thing, but I'm curious if any of you watching if you wear nail, red nail polish, do you have any problems where it comes off on things? Like when I don't even mean it to, but see how the red, uh, where is it? Right there, I don't know if you can see. It comes off on paper or anything white or light color. And I was just curious, I've used different kinds of nail polish. I've used top, different kinds of top coat. And it seems like that always happens so I was just curious if you run into that and if you have a solution for that. So it seems to be going on pretty smooth. Yeah, it just feels, kind of feels a little bit heavier than a moisturizer, but it's definitely not weighing on, you know, it doesn't feel weighty on my skin. It feels very moisturizing, even applying it. So I'm not going to do the neck today. It's very light weight. It's a bit of the mini, so I'm not sure exactly how many uses you would get out of the mini, but it's good to test. It's more of just like a couple sample, or to use a couple times sample probably. Yep. I'm going to leave this on for about 15 minutes and I will be back to rinse it off and see what it looks like. Okay, so it's been 15 minutes and I just wanted to show you before I washed it off, it did dry down definitely and get a lighter green color. It doesn't feel real tight or sometimes mask gets so tight that you feel like you can barely talk. It doesn't feel that way. It does just feel like it dried down some. So I just wanted to kind of give you that heads up you know, it definitely is kind of the skin is popping through in some areas. So I will go rinse my face and I'll be right back. Okay, so I am all rinsed off and I will say I think that it does leave my skin feeling kind of plumped um, in a good way, you know, just really moisturized. I don't feel like I need to put a moisturizer on. I probably will just because I do have pretty dry skin, but it's not pulling or feeling tight like some masks do where I feel like I instantly have to put a moisturizer on. This is available. This is again the um, sample. This is a 0.5 ounce and the full size for 2.0 ounces is $45, $44 excuse me, on their website. The main ingredients are kale, spinach, green tea, alfalfa, vitamin C, E, and K. So very clean, made in the U.S really like that. There is a little bit of tingling on my forehead, but other than that, I don't really feel anything except I do feel really clean and just like my skin is nourished. So I will use this again. I don't know if I'd purchase it 
and that's mostly just because with so many masks out there I feel like I want to try as many as I can and I don't really want to commit I think to one um, brand with mask because there's just too many to try but I do like it and I will say I think I've said it on a previous video but ever since I've been starting to do mask weekly my skin really does kind of have an inner glow and just is very clear and not as dry as it used to be I used to get really bad dry patches right here and just kind of around my nose and that has lessened for sure so I would definitely recommend no matter what mask you want to do sheet mask you know an application mask like this to make sure that you do one regularly I hope you enjoyed this video and kind of seeing what the youth to the people is all about again tomorrow sure. tomorrow because I will be doing a full review on you to the people and talk a little bit more about the company but my first impressions of using this mask is it does feel nice very clean I feel like it is good for my skin and that I'm not worried about you know any damage that it's doing to my skin and very moisturizing. I hope you enjoyed this so if you did please give me a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and see you back here tomorrow. Bye!